On the ninth day of war, Bhishma launched a fierce attack on the Pandavas as though to conquer them. Krishna had motivated Arjuna to fight with all his heart to combat the fierce attack. Arjuna, you are not fighting as you should. Without attacking Bhishma, you cannot dream of victory against the Kauravas. Krishna, I don't want to attack my great-grandfather who has brought me up from childhood. Arjuna, please understand the realities of war. On the battlefield, there is no place for sentiments. Do your duty as a Kshatriya. I will follow your advice, Krishna. I will attack my Bhishma. Look at Bhishma. His body is convulsed with arrows because of Arjuna's skill. Bhishma has fallen down from the chariot and is laid on a bed of arrows waiting for his last hour. Sons, I am blessed with the power of choosing the time of my death. I will leave this world when the sun turns to the north. Till then, I will live on this bed of arrows. Arjuna, you can help me rest my head properly. Sure, Grandfather. Tormented by great thirst. Can you give me water? Oh, grandsire, kindly have this water and fresh fruits. Son, I have given up all worldly pleasures, so I can't have delicacies. Arjuna, can you help me? Sure, here, grandfather. Son, Arjuna, I am proud of you. Thank you for bringing the river Ganga to quench my thirst. It is all your blessing, Grandfather. Duryodhana, you are dear to me. Please stop this war and compromise with the Pandavas. Otherwise, your race will be doomed. <laughs> 